The class now entering the ring are our candidates for junior champion of the International Brown Swiss Show. Our judges have truly had their work cut out for them this afternoon and evening, having placed 212 head of North America's finest brown Swiss. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together once again for our International Brown Swiss Show judge, Mr. Chris Hill of Thurmont, Maryland, and his associate judge, Sean Johnson of Glenville, Pennsylvania. What a tremendous show it's been thus far. And at this time, we'd like to welcome back to the ring those individuals that placed first and second in their respective classes today. Our parade of candidates for junior champion are led by the winning spring heifer calves, of which there were 44 today. The winner of that large class was entry 2090, Blue Diamond Parker Gia ET, exhibited by Elizabeth and Elise Ragushi of Modesto, California. Second place in that spring calf class went to entry 2070, Glenisleigh Beaver Fairy Tale, exhibited by Lookout and Gerald Halbach of Canton de Hatley, Quebec. Our spring calves are followed by the winning winter calves. Entry 2139 took top honors in that class. She is New View S Encore, exhibited by John and Bonnie Ayers and Dr. Kenny Mannion of Mechanicsburg, Ohio. The second place entry in that class of 37 was entry 2152, Carlin Gibb Rosalia, exhibited by Carlin Swiss and Jeff Brown of Jackson Center, Ohio. The fall heifer calf class had 36 entries. Topping that class was entry 2161, Top Acres Braden Wizza ET, exhibited by Lindsay Rocks of Okeechobee, Florida. 2177 stood second to her. Our Way Seaman Fancy, exhibited by Our Way Holsteins and Nathan Johnson, Brooklyn, Wisconsin. Next, we welcome the summer yearlings. There were 32 shown in that class. Winning top honors was entry 2232, Nearman's Durham Rhoda, exhibited by Braylon Hosley of Monroe, Wisconsin. 2229 is the second place summer yearling. She is Brooke Hollow Total Party, exhibited by Delbert and Heather Yoder of West Salem, Ohio. Representing the winning spring yearlings are entry 2258, Genlar Carter Trix, twin, exhibited by Brianna Meyer of Chilton, Wisconsin, and entry 2267, Brown Heaven Bloom Bubblegum ET, exhibited by Bradner Farms of Abbotsford, British Columbia. There were 26 spring yearlings shown today. The winter yearling class had 22 entries. 2279 was named the winner, North Lane Braid Present ET, exhibited by Leslie and Linda Brushy of Westminster, Ohio. Entry 2285, Top Acres HPB Weiser ET, is exhibited by Carol Ragusi and Louis Oliveira of Modesto, California. And finally, the last two candidates for our junior champion of this International Brown Swiss show are entry 2303, Cutting Edge A Ruby, exhibited by John and Bonnie Ayers and Kenny Mannion of Mechanicsburg, Ohio, and entry 2296, Doc Haven Braden Desiree, exhibited by Jeffrey McKissick of Newcastle, Pennsylvania. Again, there were 212 heads shown this afternoon. Ladies and gentlemen, let's put our hands together for the best of the best. These are your candidates for junior champion of the International Brown Swiss Show 2016. Judge Hill, the floor is yours. Introduce us to your junior champion of the International Brown Swiss Show. Well, first we should introduce these exhibitors to another huge round of applause. Come on, folks. I guarantee you they spent a lot more money than you did to get here. Without any further ado, I just, I'm tickled to death with the way these heifers came back. I think we set a pattern early and I think we stuck with it. These five heifers, uh, they, they rock. They're heifers with Great rib structures. I mean, if you're up in the stands, you can see it. We have a pattern. We like them dairy. We like them wide muzzle. We like them good legged. We like them good butted. We like them hard topped. And these five, not to mention the other ones, and a boatload of them back in the barn. This has been a phenomenal Brown Swiss show. I think we all know it. 
But the way these heifers sorted themselves, I've watched this show for a many a year, and, and I don't know if I've ever seen this many. Just heifers come to the top, heifers that are dialed in, heifers that you can tell these people just work with them day in and day out. And I'm not one to preach about the dedication, devotion, blah, 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 but that's what it takes. Give them another big round of applause, folks. This is, and I know we got a cow show tomorrow. It's not that late. Sean and I are going to go to dinner. We're going to watch Survivor, and then we're going to bed. So you don't have no threats or nothing stupid happening. But, folks, appreciate these heifers. <laughs> to say a little bit about each one of them, the baby March calf, I've told you a lot about her. So I don't want to be a broken record, but she's got what I'm looking for. December calf, she follows right along in that pattern. She's hard topped, she's clean, she's dairy, she's open, she's good legged, wide butted, tail head sets right down between her pins like I like to see. Senior calf, slam dunk winner in her class, an October calf. She big, but not only is she big, she's awful, awful good. She's striking, sharp, clean, dairy open, great legged. Winter yearling. Balance, breed character, dariness, strength. She don't need no hair. She's, she's just wide, fancy, great-legged. Senior yelling, follows right along in the pattern of the other four. These heifers here, awesome heifers. And I'm going to select your junior champion, reserve, honorable mention, and... Uh, Let's bring the house down because I am super duper comfortable with it. I don't know any brown Swiss breeders, nothing. And uh, I don't think. But uh, I really, really look forward to tomorrow. Sean does as well. And with no further ado, we're going to select your junior champion, your reserve and honorable mention. These three put it all together for us, folks. Not taking away, nothing away from the other two. But these three heifers, get them side by side there, Black Star. I mean, they go together awesome. And they're dairy, they're cut. They got breed character to burn. And uh, give them another big round of applause. Guys, back in the barn, you're doing a great job. Get them ready tomorrow, and we're awfully, awfully excited. Congratulations. Yes, congratulations to our junior champion of the show. She is entry 2279, the winning winter yearling North Lane Braid Present ET, exhibited by Leslie and Linda Broshi of Westminster, Maryland. Reserve junior champion goes to entry 2161, the winner of the fall calf class, Top Acres Braden Wizza ET, exhibited by Lindsay Rux of Okeechobee, Florida. And honorable mention to our spring calf, entry 2090, Blue Diamond Parker Gia ET, exhibited by Elizabeth and Elise Ragusi of Modesto, California. Congratulations. <laughs> 